So, Hugh Bliss, what brings you to WARP? I too am here to meet Myra. <gasps> How do you know we came for Myra? Oh, 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 <laughs> oh, don't you see? I can read your mind. As the resident Doubting Thomas of this crime-fighting duo, I consider it my civic duty to say, prove it. Okay, think of something, anything. Six million three hundred and seventy-three thousand four hundred eleven point nine eight. Sam? Lucky guess. Was it? Think of something else. Enough of this ridiculous farce! Stop it! <laughs> do me! Do me! Oh, oh my! And that's unspeakably depraved! Yeah, you got it! Wow, you're amazing! What's your business with Myra? I'm to be a guest on her show, silly. Yeah, silly! I'm spreading the word about my new book, Emetics, the handbook for multicolored happiness. Take a copy when you leave. Can you just give us the ten-word summary instead? We're on a pretty tight schedule. Ten words? Oh my! How about prismatology is the answer? Unicorns are pretty, and rainbows too! That's ten. Dazzle us with a feat of ledger domain, why don't you? Okay, I'll show you the magic of prismatology in action. Pick a color, any color. Ochre, ochre! No, mauve! Bird sienna! Uh, how about a color I've heard of, hmm? Pick a color, as long as it's red, green, or blue. It's not easy being green. Oh, but it is, with magic! <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Is it real, or is it illusion? Say, Hugh Bliss, can we get a picture with you for our scrapbook of instantly forgettable memories? Splendid idea. I wish I'd thought of it. Oh, and in fact, I did. He, hence the camera. Now gather round. But how will you take the picture? By magic. Okay. Say, chocolate-covered puppies! Chocolate-covered chocolate -covered puppies. puppies! So where's the picture, Magic Man? Oh, my. I seem to have misplaced it. <gasps> hmm, check your pockets. Maybe I left it there. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt your little joy fest, but I've got a situation here. Never fear, pretty lady. Hugh Bliss is here. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, our game show host went on Myra hours ago, and he still hasn't come out. Think you can fill in till he gets back? Can a butterfly fly? Yes, it can. Oh, what do I do? When a contestant comes to the podium, just read him a question from the card. Then, when he gets it wrong, insult him and tell him to get off the stage. Oh, no, no. Prismatology teaches us to love everyone, no matter what. Right, just read the cards. Okay. I still love you. <sighs> nah. We've got a contestant, people! Hit it! From somewhere deep within the bowels of WARP, it's Who's Never Going to Be a Millionaire? With special guest host, Hugh Bliss. Hi, I'm Hugh Bliss. Our first contestants are a pair of professional running over things. Please welcome Sam and Max. Listen, Sam, they love us. Welcome! You know the rules. If you can answer even one question correctly, you'll walk away a millionaire! Start loading the armored cars, Hugh, because my brain's stuffed with enough worthless trivia to power a small Chilean village for decades. It's true! Okay, are you ready? Oh, happy day. It's an easy one! 
if a man sets out from the Horsehead Nebula in a spaceship traveling at thrice the speed of light, and his father leaves from Rigel 2 at the same time going half the speed, how many nanoseconds will it be before time paradox causes the first man never to have been born? I'm going to go with my gut and say, you bliss. I'm flattered, but no, that is completely wrong. You lose! This is an outrage. I demand a recount. We do have a fabulous consolation prize. A copy of Emetics by me, Hugh Bliss. No thanks. I'm content to leave with just my burning shame and newfound sense of inadequacy. Okay! Find out which poor schmuck will be the next to blow his chance at millions right after these messages. Hey, a perfect fit. We've got another contestant. Hit it! Welcome back. Our next contestants are these guys again. Okay, are you ready? Hmm, the question is, am I blue? No, Hugh, you're not blue. Oh dear! Oh me, oh my! That's absolutely right! Yes. Congratulations! You're a millionaire! We're rich! Filthy rich! We just went bankrupt, so we will not be back after these messages. I don't believe it. Well, this is awkward, but we don't actually have a million in cash. Sweet mother of all quiz show scandals. We'll have to give you a million dollars worth of food stamps. They're right over there. Hold on. Can you buy deep-fried licorice ropes with food stamps? We'll take it. One. Two. Three. One hundred seventy-four. One hundred seventy-five. Nine hundred ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. And a million. Let's go spend it, Sam. It's burning a hole in my pocket. It's putting quite a bulge in mine. Sam, this is perfect. This photo is a capstone. It succinctly summarizes over 30 years of extraterrestrial-related photographic evidence. Sybil, that photo is a hoax. Exactly. I couldn't have asked for better. Now I can print the paper. <laughs> Available at newsstands now. We're famous. Hooray! Can we begin misbehaving now? Begin?
It's Saturn Max. I saw you on the telly. How do you watch TV from in there? I've got monitors you don't even know about. We want to buy something. Quite so. We come bearing one million American dollars. Now hand over the voice modulator. Blimey! Food stamps? I suppose I must accept them. Both the dash government conspiracy. It's hogwash! Complete codswallop! Here then is your chemical-based voice modulator. This is a helium balloon strapped to an inhaler. But it works! Trust me, trust me! Holy chipmunk, Ari is warbling out of a souped-up 78-speed turntable. It works! Thanks, Bosco! A little ketchup is always good on a cake. Where are we going, Sam? The TV studio. Goody! Happy birthday! Oh, boy! Birthday cake! That red frosting looks tasty! Excuse me. Boy, that was really... Oh, uh, uh, really? Uh, uh oh. Time out for number two! What? What the? Darn it! He better not be going to see Myra! Well, anyway, we can't wait. We'll just have to finish the show with only two judges. Whatever you guys agree on goes. Vote for me! Testing. One, two, three. Hey, can I try my pipes out on this thing? Go right ahead. Frankly, we can use all the contestants we can muster. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our next contestant, Sam. Hello. I'd like to do a little song I call... Busted Down Hound Dog Blues. <clears throat> Chomping on a crunchy silver spoon. She's at brunch today with some baboon. Road to someday, bits of me are strewn. And let's hear from our judges. Bravo! Your wobbly tenor is way better than Peeper's shrill squawking. You really nailed that high note! Whoa! And you're less sloppy than my brother is. You got my vote. Hey! All of the remaining judges have agreed. We have a winner! No! Congratulations, Sam. Here's your recorded contract. Ben Bottom Records. It's like a dream come true. Specs, I'll get you for this if it's the last thing I do! Right after I get back from Mount Rushmore. Rushmore? I'd better go after him. I just remembered. I have to feed my goldfish. Are we still taping? Uh, be sure to join us next time on Embarrassing Idol!
It's polite to knock. You do know we're taping a show here. Great day in the morning. It's Myra Stump herself! Yourself. 